Welcome back, everybody, to some more P5R. I'm your host, The Musical Gamer. Congrats on surviving midterms, all you guys out there, because I know I have. <sighs> I think I'm screwed for real this time. I couldn't concentrate at all. Oh? What the hell? Wait, what is going on out there? Quiet down! Can't you see I'm recording? Again? It's so damn loud! More importantly, what's this you want to talk about? You said that something was on your mind before, but were you able to figure out what it was? Yeah, what's uh, what's going on, Futaba? The medjet that I banned wasn't the real one. Oh? Huh? Aren't you the real one, though? Oh, uh... The guy who called himself Medjet after me isn't the one from the other day. What do you mean? The code written by that guy the other day is different from any of the past Medjed. And that means... Yeah, where are you going with this? A code is like your fingerprints. No matter how you try to disguise it, your own quirks appear in it. The one from the other day was all cut and pasted with no consistency. No skill at all. But aren't there multiple people across the world that are part of Medjed? Couldn't it have been done by someone that joined recently? How do I put it? That code was so not done by anyone interested in cracking. At all. At the very least, there's no way it was an official Medjed member. So someone used the Medjed name to provoke the Phantom Thieves? For what purpose? Could they have been doing it for fun? Uh, I doubt that. That'd be a really weird game. It was around the time our group started getting popular, so maybe they wanted in on the hype. Wait a moment. What if it's the other way around? Hmm? Perhaps they use the Medjed name to make the Phantom Thieves known. What? That makes no sense! Well, hold on, wait, no, 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 let, let, her, let her talk it out. I actually thought the same as Makoto. Because it makes some sense. Make us known, and then watch us fall. Why is that? Know how I just said that code is like fingerprints? I found those same fingerprints somewhere completely different. Where's that? The Phantom Aficionado website. There were traces of it being illegally tampered with from the outside. Oh? For real? Does Mishima know about this? For summer vacation, the access counter was made to be much higher than the actual number. Same with the rankings. Particularly the time when President Okumura ranked first. Somebody was inflating the numbers. So then, the one who provoked the group and the one who tampered with the site are the same person? I think I'm starting to see the big picture. Both Medjed's provocation and the tampering of the website brought attention to us as a result. On top of that, our reason for targeting Okumura was influenced by the public and the rankings. The perfect timing and the perfect target. If both of those had been set up... It would all make sense. Yeah, we were, we were the patsies. The fall guy. So the culprit was planning to put the blame on us from the start? No way. This is all hypothetical. We lack any hard evidence. But if all your deductions happen to be correct, that would mean we've been playing right into their hand for the past two months or so. We gotta be overthinking things. I mean, we're talking both the rankings and Medjet. I don't know, man. Sometimes the simplest solution is the, is the correct one. Everyone made a big deal about it. If this was all set up, then... What kind of guy did we make an enemy of? That's a very good question. Somebody with power. There's no point in getting anxious over speculation. Regardless, we'll be falsely charged at this rate, and with murder. We must overcome this. But we don't even know who we're up against. Hey, you think we're falling into another trap, even at this very moment? Oh, hold on, calm down. Yeah. This doesn't mean that we've lost yet. <laughs> Calm your goddamn tits, Ryuji. Even if this is the actions of a meticulous enemy, we'll just have to get back at them. We need to find clues, no matter what. Agreed. Well, it's interesting. It's not really a lead, but it's a, a direction? Me? I was told you recommended this reassignment yourself, sir. Why would you choose someone as inexperienced as myself? 
When the case of the Shujin Principle was ruled a suicide, you thought to reopen it. And you proved its connection to the Phantom Thieves. This is based primarily on that achievement. I'm honored, sir. The Phantom Thieves issue is now a national crisis. Expectations are exceedingly high for us public prosecutors, as we are the executors of justice. Personnel and planning will be up to you on this case. You will also have the police under your command. I'd like you to oversee this operation. <sighs> You've yet to give an answer. Will you accept the task of eradicating the Phantom Thieves? I will give it everything I have. We'll have to prepare a higher position for you as well in the event that you succeed. I don't wish to apply extra pressure on you, but I assume your odds of success are high. Naturally, failure to accomplish this task is unacceptable. Do you understand? Of course. I will live up to your expectations no matter what it takes. That is all, then. I expect good results from you. Winds of change I'm are blowing home. everywhere. Hey, look who's back. Hi, sis. Should I warm up dinner for you? No, it's okay. How about a bath? No need. I just came home to get a change of clothes. Are you going to stay at work, then? I've been entrusted with a very important task. You look awful, though. Aren't you tired? As an adult, there will be times when you will accept an assignment for which failure is not tolerated. It's all over for me if I can't win this. Still, if you were to collapse from exhaustion... This is my one chance to get a promotion. I heard detectives have been coming to your school. That must make it hard to focus on your studies. Don't worry, though. It will all be over soon. What do you mean? I'm going to catch the Phantom Thieves myself. Is that the important task you mentioned? <laughs> she says this, but she doesn't realize she's been living with one. It's none of your concern. Oh my god. Yeah, that's, uh, that's some bad news. Sis has her sights set on the Phantom Thieves, and on Shujin Academy in particular. She's getting a little close. This is bad. I need to let everyone know. It won't be too long before she figures everything out. Ring a ding ding. Here it comes. Things have become somewhat troublesome, everyone. Just try to stay calm. What's wrong? Sis told me she's been entrusted with an important task regarding the Phantom Thieves. That means... Yes. The SIU must surely be on the move at this point. Uh, that's bad. Wait, were they already investigating us, though? The police were doing so in secret. This operation's on a much different scale. Hold on a sec, what's this SIU thing anyway? The Special Investigations Unit. An elite team that deals with huge cases like government scandals. I have heard that name on the news. They make headlines often. The real insane part is they haven't lost a case against a suspect in like 50 years. If they come after you, you're screwed. They're the best investigation force in Japan. Are we going to get arrested? Doesn't this countermeasure seem somewhat extreme? Right or wrong, I think we're just way too famous at this point. As this is a country governed by law, they can't afford to ignore us for any longer. We may be the Phantom Thieves, but this is miserable. They probably have a pretty narrow suspect profile by now, too. Hey, don't scare us like that! It's okay, though. They don't have enough uh, it. They don't have any evidence. Yes, I expect they're frantically searching for some as we speak. No way they're gonna find anything, though. It's only a matter of time. We have to hurry and do something about this. Yeah. Uh, everything's going to be fine. Unless they know about the metaverse, there's no way they'll get any info on us. The most they could probably do is pin... Not even pin, but realize the weird coincidences relating to all of us hanging out together. But that's not really much of evidence to be able to prove, you know, anything one way or the other. Lovely. It looks like we can't do shit tonight. Hey. Tomorrow to think about. Let's call Kawakami another time. Damn it. I got like nothing to do. Nothing to do. 
<sighs> oh well. Uh, hold on, wait, can we like brew this, uh, let's brew this, let's brew this masterwork coffee, shall we? I like, I like, the, I like that idea. Uh, while we do, so, actually no, not while we do so. Let's just, let's just brew some coffee. Yo. And once it gets started, huh? There's a lot to know and enjoy about coffee. Let's brew, let's make a brew. We should be able to make that super masterwork brew. Yes! Alright. Two master coffees. And the chief's gentlemanly charm is rubbing off on us. Well, we, we'll take the SP restorative items. It's about, like, all we could do. <laughs> so you're at it again. How's it going? You know, take a sip, coffee dad. How does, uh, how does it taste? Mmm. It's Mexican Altura. Let me explain. Coffee was said to be brought into Mexico by the Spanish in the 18th century. Mexico is now one of the world's largest coffee producers. Altura, meaning height in Spanish, describes the altitude the beans were grown. It is a savory aroma, soft acidity, and nutty flavor. And that has been the coffee <sighs> trivia for tonight. Wow, he is super impressed. It's worth a compliment. Hey, that ain't half bad. Sorry about the other day. Thank you for sticking up for Futaba. I might be worried, but I want you to let me handle this. I made up my mind. I'll do anything for you two. I want you to let me do my job as a guardian. I'm glad I at least was able to teach you how to brew coffee that tastes this good. Well, shit! He actually had something to say about it. Huh. Fair enough. Well, I will take the master coffee, at the very least. Oh, God, it's still dropping. Damned Phantom Haven't Thieves. Haven't they found the Phantom Thieves yet? The government and the police are useless. Are they even trying? Wish they wouldn't spend tax dollars just to sit on their asses. <laughs> that's a that's a complaint everybody has. <laughs> it's just everybody knows tax dollars don't go to shit. <laughs> you never see where your money's going. I think that's most of the frustration. Oh, the police are here again. Guys, I'm getting a little nervous. They were there today too, right? Yeah, what do those damn cops think they are? They can't just stare us all down like that. Maybe the rumors are true. Maybe there's a phantom thief at our school. There's <laughs> more than just a thief. Oh god, and there comes somebody who knows. Okay, quiet down. At least you're here at the school, so be sure not to get in their way. Oh, and for various reasons, the school festival got moved to the 25th. I was talking of canceling it, but we couldn't just do that. I'm sure the preparations will be rough, but don't push yourselves too hard. Really? On a weekday? What kind of reasons are there? Well, the stuff about the principal and Kamashita this year, I guess it's no surprise. Well, looks like the school festival is in just a mere four days, everybody. A mere four days. Apparently the police are going to be interrogating all the students here. Seriously? The police are choochy. They haven't come to my school. Seems they're calling out students individually out of class to speak with them. Well, they're not going to come to your school, Yusuke, because you're the only one there. Nothing has happened at your school. Wait, does that mean we're going to get called in too? Second years will start in the afternoon. Make sure you prepare yourselves mentally for this. You've got to be looking for the culprit, right? Who knows? Be careful, guys. You should probably try not to say much. They'll see if there are any lies you might try telling. I know. Oh, boy. That's disconcerting. Well, time to go screw with the cops. Well, then, next up is Takamaki-san and... Oh, and me. You two will go together. Huh? Why together? Why? They'll probably have one of you wait outside. That's how they've been doing it so far. Uh, oh, yeah. Right. Those are the instructions the detectives gave us. Just don't say more than is necessary and try and get it over with quick. <laughs> no need to tell me twice. Take a seat. Uh, hello there, gentlemen. How do you do? We're sorry to take your time. This will be over quick. Let's see. Ah, yes. You're the one currently under probation. Gee, thanks. Glad you guys know that. It says here you had a dispute with Mr. Kamashita. Yeah, that happened. You're more hot-blooded than you look. You spend time with quite an interesting group. 
Yusuke Kitagawa and Haru Okumura? The more friends, the better, right? I'm sorry to have taken your time. You're free to go now. Oh, I almost forgot. There's just one more thing I have to ask you. Do you think the Phantom Thieves are associated with this school? Hmm. <laughs> Is that really true? We won't know for certain unless we investigate further. Thank you for your time. Your responses will serve as great reference material. Well, that doesn't make me feel Takami any better. Takami-san is next. Could you ask her to come in? All right, well, on. Oh, you and your world-class acting. It's going to get us into a lot of shit if you can't pull it together. I got so nervous, I almost stuttered a few times. I thought I was used to police questioning by now, too. Yeah, me too. It seems we were all asked the same questions. That's how they get you. They do that on purpose, then wait for someone to slip up. I hope you didn't. It was probably fine. Oh, I would have been done for if they saw how sweaty my hands were, though. To think my name would come up as well. Yeah, they were asking about you. Sounds like we can't take the police lightly, either. Hey, didn't you think that detective guy was scary? Well, I mean, he seemed kind of normal to me. Not to me. He looked like someone who's dealt with dangerous criminals. You forget. According to them, I am a dangerous criminal. I'm sorry for all of this. It's because of my sister. Rather be a smooth criminal. That's not true, Mako-chan. It's not as though I hadn't predicted this would happen. But now that it's become reality, I'm unsure of what to do. We need to make sure we don't draw suspicion and work to clear our names. Right. It ain't your fault, Makoto. I'm gonna try to see how far along this investigation really is. Just don't get I'm caught. I'm worried about the police, too, but as of now, anyone in this city could be a mole. They were so popular, too. Haru, can I ask you to search your father's belongings for clues about a possible culprit? I... I know it may be tough on you. No, it's okay. Now isn't the time for me to look away. As for everyone else, you need to be cautious of how you spend your time at school. So, I've decided to have you three second years join me on the school festival executive committee. Why? Well, it makes some sense. At least it gives us a reason to be seen together. It will allow us to gather without drawing suspicion. Plus, trying to blend in will only do the opposite. Ah, uh, fine. I agree. The more time I have to kill, the more time I'll spend worrying about all this stuff. No matter what happens, I don't want to regret my decisions. Don't jinx it! <laughs> it would be no surprise if they came directly to our homes for questioning. They showed up at your school after all. For now, the best option is to stay on the defensive. But we won't make progress at this rate. Let's try and figure out who the real culprit is somehow, okay? Of course. Yeah, that's the plan. <laughs> God, but we have an uphill battle. That is not going to be an easy thing to do. <sighs> well, no time like the present. Better get started. Someone totally framed us. Yeah, you think so too, huh, buddy? Ugh. And great, looks like we can do anything we want around here, except actually do shit. Lovely. All right, well, I guess on that note... Not really anything to do, but uh, maybe some games. Maybe actually, we could probably try to finish this video game. Oh. Let us play a game. We have just one more to do with power intuition. Might as well. We got nothing better to do with ourselves. Okay. Uh, yes. Let us use the technique. I suppose. Mm. It's the final opponent. Wait, it's just a little old lady. Damn it, you move so fast and deal so much damage. <laughs> you land a special attack. All right, sure. Let's do it. Go, 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 go. Ooh. She's on her heels. Uh, wait, what the fuck? Ah! Wait, what? And eh, 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 Okay. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me! What the- what the fuck game?! What the hell? 
What the hell? Why is this so difficult? Come on! Come on, please! Oh, I'm having so much trouble with this. Why? What? I can't get the... There we go! Oh my lord! What beautifully flowing combos. That was amazing. Why well, don't even know what I did? This is why I don't play fighting games. Okay. Hmm. Holy crap, can you imagine me trying to do that without the cheats? No, thank you. Mayo says if you send the password, you see if you're the enemy, you get a prize. Sure. We can take this fighting card to the game store. Nice. I just, I can't even. Oh man. What were they thinking? Yes. I have another suggestion. Call for the arrest of the Phantom Thieves, then mobilize the police. The rest will go as you mentioned. <laughs> Still, I'm truly amazed at the atrocious methods you come up with. People still be talking. Our popularity still be plummeting. We're at 25%. Can you imagine that like just uh, a week and a half ago, oh, or two weeks ago, we were on? sitting at like 93% approval? Ugh, oh, God. All right, well, either way, let us just go and get ready for this festival. I don't even care what people say anymore. I just want to have fun. I want to kick my feet up. I want to be able to let my hair down. And I just want to groove, man. Speaking of the annoying media, we've been getting phone calls in the faculty office. The absurdity of it all. Who exactly are the Phantom Thieves? That's what we want to know. We really have no clue what method they're using. Killing someone without directly interacting with them is like magic. Speaking of magic, did you know that there's magic in math too? A magic square! Oh god. Oh, not this. Oh no. No two squares can contain the same number. Now tell me the total count for each column in this magic square. The total number for each column? Two squares can contain the same number. Oh, 15. Okay, sure. I'll just follow the crowd. Correct. It's easy once you know which numbers fill fit in the empty squares. Yeah, I'd say so. A three by three square has only only has one pattern, but a four by four square has 880 possibilities. In a five by five square, there are more than 200 million. Can you believe that? Yes, nice thanks. Going. I, uh, I'm pretty smart. <laughs> Last I checked, I think I'm gonna ace these ex uh, ace this exam. Uh, math doesn't kill anyone. <laughs> math killed me in high school. I don't know what you're talking about. I got yelled at so much for doing so bad in math. Don't even, don't even get me started. So what we gotta do is the school festival's exec committee. I need some help with the questionnaires. What questionnaires? Regarding who people want to see as the guest of honor? All right, that thing they do every year. You mean how those lame guests come to a panel, right? Festival's dates were changed because of the situation. We need to hurry and tally the results. Come to the student council room once classes are over. Oh, it's so damn boring. Don't be like that. It's so we can meet up without standing out. Let's do what we can at the, at the moment. Make it sure to work hard at home. But you do that all the time. I can look stuff up. So did you find anything, Haru? About that. No good, huh? I'm sorry. I'll rouse suspicion if I ask too many detailed questions. Alright, well, yeah, we're counting on you. Can't go but message me if anything happens. We'll leave this to you guys. My apologies, but I cannot be of much help in this situation. Yeah, you do go to a different school. So Yusuke's gonna be kinda out of the loop. Maybe that's for the best. Damn it. We don't have time to be doing crap like this. You don't need to keep mentioning it. We're doing this to keep suspicions off of us, remember? Goro Akechi. This one too, Akechi. They're mostly the same over here as well. Oh no. Everyone's so eloquent when they can be anonymous. It's like they never accepted us to begin with. It would be nice if you did some work too, Ryuji-kun. 
He came to help us count these, right? Come on, leader. Can you tell him too? <sighs> Dude, just not I'm actually tired. Oh god, take this seriously, god damn it. We're gathering information too. You know, like uh, online and stuff. Uh-huh. I guess that's one way of saying it. Whoa, look here. This ain't good. Criminal profiling? The acts of thievery committed by the Phantom Thieves are mere fakes. And their true goal is murder? Every heart they changed before Okumura was just a warm-up? Uh, so now they're accusing us of being a bunch of killers. God, this is so effing stupid! Damn it! What are we supposed to do? We have the results. First place is Goro Akechi. What? Akechi? What are you so surprised for? We've been mentioning him this whole time. You have not been paying attention one bit. Literally, we've been saying how many fucking votes are coming in for the dude. Seriously? Not some singer or an idol? It's because of us that his popularity has skyrocketed. We're the ones counting the results. Can't we just make him up? We don't have to get him. People will figure that out. He won by a landslide. I knew people would vote for him, but this is way more votes than I was expecting. It's kind of depressing. It would be best for us to avoid inviting such a clear danger upon ourselves. I'd like a little more time to think about who to ask. That reminds me. How was Futaba-chan doing? She seemed like she was looking into something on her own. Has she told you anything? Well, Mum's been the word so far. Yeah, not a word. It's not that I don't trust her, but... Even one clue would work wonders for us. We should let her continue with her own investigation. I hope she finds something. Yeah, me too. For all of our sakes. Hey there, Coffee Dad. In response to the police identifying the Phantom Thieves as primary suspects, Goro Akechi had this to say. Even though my opinion has been met with criticism, I've held fast that the Phantom Thieves are not just. However, I believe the recent series of suspicious deaths is unrelated to their actions. W what? Did I hear you correctly? Oh, well, look at him. He's coming to bat for us. But Akechi-san, you were the first to caution everyone about the Phantom Thieves. Were you not? This doesn't change the fact that they are indeed a dangerous group. That said, I would like to express that immediately linking them to this case is far too hasty. There are still many questions to be answered here. It feels as though there is more to this. After this conference, Akechi-san announced he will be limiting his media appearances and... I wonder why the sudden change? That is a good question. I'm super stuck on my Okamura investigation. Seriously? Even you're having trouble with this shit? What should we do? Let's meet up and discuss our options as soon as possible. Tomorrow? The earlier the better. Though I still haven't come up with anything myself. I said two heads are better than one, so I can only imagine what eight heads may produce. That's a good way of thinking. It's totally an Inari idea. Alright, let's do everything we can right now. Even if it means crossing some dangerous bridges. Considering how far we've come, we can't be particular about our methodology. What are you staring at your phone like that for? Oh, are you going through a breakup? <laughs> of sorts. <laughs> Pretty much. Are you trying to show off? Don't get cocky, kid. By the way, you haven't been causing any trouble, have you? Well, why? Why do you ask? Police showed up at your school. It had nothing to do with me, I swear, officer. <laughs> it's nothing about me. As long as you're not getting involved. Well, fine. God, I don't want to make him worried. I just, I don't, I don't want to send him there. Hey, EY, he wishes to, he wishes to, uh, be helped. That can be arranged, my good sir. I'm pretty sure he's a, yeah, you're, you're there. Ah, Hifumi, we finally have the ability to do some confidanting again after so goddamn long. Oh my god. Lord, it's been forever. Okay, let's uh, let's quickly go to Chihaya. We need to speak to her about getting some more points with Hifumi before we do anything else. Um, Give me a fortune reading, please. 
What shall we do? Yeah, we do a quick affinity reading. Where is he for me? He for me. There you are. That is fine. <laughs> Please read the fortune. I will say this now, though. I, I was going to try to rush to finish Hifumi's, but now that we already have a request from Sojiro to deal with the mementos... Oh, that's shit. It's still not even enough. Think? All right, then, yeah, Iwai is the one we're going to hang out with no matter what. Uh, we're going to want to try to get his done soon, too, and it's going to be the same with Shinya. We're going to want all of those requests ready to go, just sitting in our uh, request uh, menu, ready to be taken care of. We're gonna have to do them all at the same time. Okay, so let us go to the airsoft shop. Iwai, buddy, old pal, old friend. We, uh, we need to talk. <sighs> Crazy out there with all these incidents happening. That'll make my job easier if the cops have their attention elsewhere, you know? Yep, I wanna work. I need you to handle some chores around the place today. No getting out of it. There's also something I wanna talk about, got time? I mean, sure. We can, uh, we can chat. Say out. Good. All right, get to work, you little gun nerd. Got a minute? All right, that's good for today. Oh, but uh, there's something I want to talk to you about. It's about that secret suit I mentioned. There's more to it than have my having been in the yakuza. Just want to make sure you don't go saying something stupid if you run into coward around here. Oh, back when I was working with the Hashima clan, some crazy lady came around our office. Must have been over ten years ago. She had this baby with her, and the whole time she was there, she kept going on about how she wanted to sell it. What? Sell the baby? She was just some cracked up junkie looking for drug money. Then when I told her no, she sat the baby down and ran off. That baby was Kaoru. Oh! <laughs> Thinking back on it, I'm still not really sure why I took him in. Not only did I have to leave the clan, but now I'm stuck running this shop I don't even like. <laughs> Every day's an uphill battle. Still haven't managed to tell Kaoru I was in the Yakuza, though. Well, why not? Let me ask you something. How would you feel if you found that your parents were wrapped up in some dirty shit? That's how my mom was. She'd spend every night there drinking, running around town with all sorts of guys. Couldn't stand to see her destroy herself like that. Often I wished I could have had someone else as my mom. So I didn't want to make Kaoru go through the same thing. I wanted to make sure he had a good childhood. That's why I left the clan. I did everything according to the code, but now that suit is dragging me back. Once I remembered I run once he remembered I run this fake gun shop, he came by asking me to make custom models for him. Though he wasn't really asking. The bastard forced me into it by threatening to tell Kaoru everything. Truth is, suit has got all sorts of dirt. Not just on what happened when Kaoru was a baby, but on me and the rest of the family too. Who knows what had happened if Kaoru learned the truth. Suit isn't gonna stop there, though. Sure, he'd go on and tell everyone else he could. When it's all said and done, I'm, he's gonna try and take everything I have. Shit. Before he gets out about my past, people are gonna treat Kaoru like he's no different than me. After all, everyone knows shitty parents end up making shitty kids. Once he's got that stigma, he'll be stuck with it. When shit goes wrong, he'll always be the one who gets blamed. That's how it was with me. <clears throat> when I turned to the Yakuza, nobody else would accept me. It's also why I can't turn Suda down. He's just got too much power. Damn, that is a story. EY, second best persona dad. <laughs> oh man. It is uh that is that is that is a that is a story. You're uh You're pathetic. <laughs> yeah, that right. Oh, I was hoping to maybe like light a fire under his ass. The cow is sick of having a weak ass dad like me. Anyways, I was trying to stall Suda with bullshit prototype, so I figured it's a way out to stop him. That batter's real, bastard's real good at keeping his cards close to his chest. As he got wind of what I was trying to do, and he started keeping tabs on me 24-7. Thankfully, it's just about when you shut up, kid. Sorry. Sorry for bringing all that shit up out of the blue. Probably don't want anything to do with me after that, huh? <sighs> Look. <laughs> just let me stick around for the guns. Don't, uh... <laughs> Don't make me think too hard in this. You're seriously into this enthusiast shit. Alright, just remember I never gave you a reward for that info. You're right. How about I give you a discount on the special menu? I'd you keep you quiet for a while. <laughs> Pretty good deal, huh? Alright, sure. 
I'll, uh, I'll take you up on that deal. Decreases the cost of gun customization. Honestly, right. gun customization wasn't really that expensive to begin with. Not only that, I am swimming in cash. I don't even need to, I don't even need to worry about money. You could have me charge full price. Hell, you could have me pay double price. I still have plenty of money to run around with. Ring-a-ding-ding -ding with a bang. Sorry about that earlier. Didn't mean to get talking about that heavy shit. I gotta wait for that secret. Or we're gonna protect that secret, no matter what. For Calvary's sake. Well, Alright, you're right. I'll agree with you. Whatever it takes. This is why I brought it up at all. Right now, I still don't know what Suda's next move's gonna be. I'm gonna stay on guard 24-7. Don't wanna get killed in your sleep, right? God, why do you have to say it like that? Man, that's ominous. That is freaking ominous. Please don't say that to me. Makoto, has Nijima-san told you anything about the investigation? Well... Sis actually stopped mentioning anything about work in front of me. It's possible I made some sort of mistake. Regardless, I thought over the matter of who we're going to invite for our school festival. I'm considering asking Akechi kun. Well, he did win the thing. For real? Yeah, well, what, what do you want to do? If we don't, people will riot. Weren't you talking about how you didn't want to draw danger to us or whatever? I understand this is dangerous, but without a powerful source of intel, we won't be able to win against the police network. And I can no longer rely on my sister for information. Wait, is this because of Akechi-kun's police connections? You're going to use him as your powerful source of intel? It's a bold move, Cotton, but I don't I don't trust it. Bold move? <laughs> I'm surprised to hear that suggestion coming from you, Makoto. God damn it. Did you see his press conference yesterday? One of his comments defending the Phantom Thieves stood out to me. There is more to this. I think he said that knowing for certain that the Phantom Thieves would be watching. Still, there will be so many other students at the school festival. What are the odds of success? It's a gamble, and the odds are less than favorable. But at this point, it might just be a risk we have to take. But we can no longer afford to hesitate. Yeah, I agree. What are your thoughts? Should we invite a Kun? It's very dangerous, but it should be fine. Okay then. Is everyone else okay with that? I'm good. Whatever he says has got to be more reliable than what I've been able to come up with. It would be reassuring to gain him as an ally, rather than simply a source of information. Hold on, how are we even gonna get in touch with him? It's not like we got his contact info. Uh, I... I do. Actually, I do. For real? I've been hanging out with him for months. <laughs> Is this news? Could you send that my way, please? Sure. I'll contact him right away. Gotta say, I'm really not big on this Akechi deal. Now's no time to be petty. Just think of him as a source of intel. Nothing more. Now, so you say. I have a response already. He says, let me think about it. Wait a sec. Didn't he say he wasn't going to do any more stuff for the media? That's likely why he's so hesitant. What are we going to do if he turns us down? I'll keep trying. Maybe frustrating, but he's all we have at the moment. We need him to do it, no matter what. We're counting on you, Makoto. This is a this is a very risky plan, but how much else we can do? Anything else we can do? Yes, of course. Goody goody. Yeah, you're you're still doing stuff. Ah, uh, yeah, he put me not available. This is gonna be bad. Uh, hopefully, this is uh enough. If, just, just, just by doing this once, we'll have enough points to uh, make up with it. Why? Because uh, otherwise, we might be in trouble slightly, very slightly, but do? still, still there. Give me that affinity reading. Why? We're cutting it close here. Yeah, here, take the, take the money, damn it. Here we 
go. All right, please tell me this is enough points. Please. Oh, thank God. Okay, good. Whew. What do you think? Oh boy, that could have been real bad. Well, when we come back with some more P5R, we'll uh, we'll go hang out with Gun Daddy Y and uh, make sure everything's uh, hunky dory with him. <laughs> uh, and then we will begin prep for the cultural festival. This should definitely be an interesting time, but uh, I will see you guys in the next video where we uh, talk to this fine, dapper ex gang man. I'll see you guys then. This is the Musical Gamer signing off. If you enjoyed it, let me know down below. Check me out on Patreon. A dollar a month goes a long way to keeping this channel up and running. And I'll see you guys next time. Later.